Welcome to the Pokemon Squad, guys. I'm just going to do a short little review on this binder that we got from Amazon for about $30. Uh, just got it out of the box. This is what it looks like. I'll leave a link in the description below. Now, it is a four pocket binder, and it is bigger than I thought it was going to be. This is the size of a normal four pocket binder. You can see there's quite a big difference. I could put this inside of there, it looks like. Uh, so if you're ordering it thinking it's going to be, you know, this big, uh, get ready because it's a lot bigger than that. Here's a, a nine pocket binder, just kind of for reference. So it's definitely quite large. Not necessarily a bad thing, though. Oh. Diz Eevee, I think there was a Bulbasaur one and a Pikachu one as well. I don't believe this is an officially licensed product. This is going to hold my wife's Eevee card collection that we've shown before. Now it does feel really nice. I think it looks really nice as well. It is a zip-up binder, which I do like. Very, very nice. A couple little creases there, but it doesn't really matter to us. So, I've not actually looked at this, but we've got all the different energy symbols. We'll go ahead and unzip it, see what it looks like inside. And here we go. So, they've not even all the way, <laughs> they're not all buckled in correctly, but you can see these are four pocket binders. These look just like they're really standard. Looks like they load from the front and from the top. Now, I personally really like the side loading binders. Uh, they seem to just hold better, and, and they load from the front and the back. Let me just make a big old mess here real quick. But, uh, you know, that is the style, really, that the standard four-pocket binders come in anyway. Does look like you can add or take out pages if you want. Uh, as you can see in here, the pages are very similar, except these are permanently attached, so you can't take any out. And that's the problem we're having is that uh, there's no room in here. There's not one room for one more card. It is completely full, uh, so that's why we ordered this. It's expandable. There's lots of room. Inside of here is like a felt material, very, very soft, very nice. I'm not sure exactly what this is, but it's on both sides. I'm just going to leave it. But all in all, it looks pretty nice. I'll load up some of the cards in here and we'll get a little bit better feel of what it looks like. So, I'll be right back. As you can see, this is just a thin. This is another type of thin one. This is thick one and this one is just as thick as our biggest binder compared to the size of a normal four pocket binder considerably larger but to us that is not a downside all right everybody i am back we've got it all loaded up and unzipped and uh held them really well and i uh, didn't add any more cards to it so if you fill up one of these little four pocket ultra Pro binders. Uh, this is, in fact, I actually found an extra card uh, that was stuck behind another one. So you'll see one kind of straggler there at the end. I said to push them a little bit. Uh, all the cards went in good. I, all these cards are sleeved uh, front and back. So, I mean, they're in there pretty good, but they fit really well too. So uh, I don't think if you hold this upside down. You know, with double sleeved, you're going to have much of an issue. So let's just flip on to the back here. And uh, this is how much more room this has than the Ultra Pro. A lot, a lot, a lot. And I do like that all these load from the front on the Ultra Pro. The front ones load from the front. And then I believe the back ones load from the back. And uh, you get halfway through and it becomes aggravating. Now, a lot of people like these. They don't have the rings. Uh, a lot of people are afraid, and probably with, you know, good measure, 
these rings can, you know, maybe damage your cards <laughs> if you're not careful. You know, they just kind of, uh, no card in here is, you know, amazingly expensive. And if we did have some, I'd just put them over here. If you put them in there and you actually pull too hard and the things just snapped off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, all in all, I really, really like this. It did cost as much as Ultra Pro's fancy nine pocket binder. So, do remember that. Now, this does not have a zip. It's just got the strap. But it does have the better pages where they side load from the front and the back, which I much more like. So just be realizing that, you know, for that same price, basically, you get less in some ways, but uh, this is a really nice alternative. Why did we get this? Because it had Eevee on it. That's the primary reason. We were looking for an Eevee binder for the Eevee cards. And uh, this was about as good as we could find. And uh, for what we wanted, it served our purposes perfectly. So I definitely recommend this product. You know, if I had to change anything, uh, I would have the side-loading sleeves. Uh, and maybe you wouldn't want the rings. They don't bother me. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this review. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe on our YouTube channel, and we'll see you next time. Good night, good pools, and God bless.